Hello everybody, I'm coming to you live from the Melbourne International Coffee Expo. Hope you can hear me okay. Give me a wave if you're on. Drop a few comments in the uh, comment section throughout this as well because if you have any questions, if there's anything you want to see, let me know and I'll do my best for you. So here we are. This is a really innovative gadget I want to show you first up. It's called Uber Milk. See behind me? Basically what it does is it steams or froths the milk um, straight to the jug. So you don't need to manually steam the milk. Yeah, I know what you're thinking. The robots are coming to take our jobs. But what this particular bit of equipment does for high volume co coffee shops is that it just cuts down on the time required to make a coffee. And the technology has really improved to the point where you can get really good milk coming out of this, this machine, perfectly frothed milk. I'm gonna try and push my way in here in a second and uh, show you an example of the milk, what it looks like. Hey Judy, we might have to come back, we'll come back. Here we go. All right, so if you don't mind doing the coffee, and then I'll pour the milk, you know. What's your name? Andreas. Andreas, people. Hi. <laughs> there we go. All right, so what do you so put in? Pretty much just touch the button. Uh, just a sec. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Oh, I can do it. I can do it. All right, I'll just flip this around. I'll put milk. Thank you, sir. Thank you. So there you have it. It's a bit hard to see, but <laughs> perfectly frothed milk. How good's that? So that basically is a machine that can froth the milk for you straight to the jug. And it's, they reckon it cuts about 25% off the time required, you know, to make a coffee. It's really quick. It's very quick. Very quick. All right. Cool. Let's move along. I want to show something over here. Here's my man. How are you, mate? Going good, mate. Going good. Just having yeah. some lunch. Say hello, everyone. Hello, everyone. Yeah. This is a cold press juicer that that Kuvings make. The best cold press juicer, mate. The best. It is. I've um, been a fan of these guys for two years. Yeah. Wow. When I first found you here at at um, at Mice Coffee Expo two years ago. Yeah. So hopefully we'll get a demo. You have your lunch. I'm having lunch. Yeah. Yeah. Will someone else be able to show us a few, few tricks? Yeah. Yeah. This guy, he's always up for some fun. How you going, mate? We're back for a demo. Yeah. yeah. What about demoing, Derek? Ah, uh, the, the cold press juicer. Yeah. This is upgraded a bowl model. Oh, that's smart, Cap. Oh, that's 
that's what you were saying before right there. Oh, yeah. No leaking, which means less cleaning. Mm. We're bros. We don't want to do it. <laughs> oh, wow, look at that. Now, how much does that hold? Is there? That's, it says 500 mils on the measure. Oh, my God, we just fill that up. I know, we just fill it up. Because we drink 500 mils on the See what it's doing? Completely yeah. pulp. Oh, is that the guy? Oh, I have had just about every drink you can imagine from. That's a good one. 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 That's a No moisture whatsoever, and the beauty of this is it's no, you know, it's fresh. You're getting the best of the fruit, absolutely. Oh, here, here's, a, here's a real authority. Oh, total authority. <laughs> How good Cold is this? Cold juice. Yeah. It doesn't get better than this, really. It doesn't get any better? No. Not when it comes to taking in your fruit and vegetables. Right, yeah. Big dose of vitamins. Yeah. What's the difference between, I don't know, a customer getting a a bottle a of juice, juice, a regular juice out of the fridge and paying, you know, whatever, five, six bucks, as opposed to getting one like this made fresh. Uh, I guess the, um, the main differences would be that uh, this hasn't had any of the enzymes cut and altered, so the enzymes are intact. Um, there's very minimal oxidation in the Kuvings machine. Uh, and you're getting your soluble fibre, not your insoluble fibre. Right. Uh, so there's many, many health benefits and a direct surge of vitamins right. that yeah. are absorbed within 10 minutes. Yeah. I've noticed that clients of mine that have bought this particular bit of gear are reporting to uh, they're actually doing just as many cold-pressed juices now as they do coffee. Yeah, well, and then they're making so much more money. Yeah, yes. well, they're actually captured a uh, whole clientele. Yeah, that's yeah. right. Yeah. It's, it's a, an emerging and fast-growing market, the cold press juice. Yeah, well, that's the thing, you know. I mean, you can have coffee in the morning and then juice in the afternoon, so you're really capitalising on two different markets. Exactly, that's right. And it's not one exclusive to the other. They, the coffee drinker will also drink juice. Sure. Yeah. Like me. The juice drinker will also have a coffee. Oh, I know I do. <laughs> Today I'm having them all together too. One yeah, maybe, the other. exactly. <laughs> Which and is working fine, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, well, you know, fully uh, charged up and coming at your life. The only thing that's missing for me is a cup of tea. A cup of tea. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going off that bottle of gin down there that they should get the gum and samples. I reckon that would be me real, real soon. Well, you could certainly take a bit of cold pressed juice and add a little nip of gin to it. Before I go, you've got to show me your bottles. They are uh, pretty special too. They are. They are. Yeah. And your straws. Straws? With straw cleaners. How good's that? So, Fantastic. we're all striving in this industry to reduce plastics and and these are reusable stainless steel. Straw, rainbow? Rainbow coloured straws, right? And they're all bent out of shape, see? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's a little bit bent out of shape. <laughs> no, that's, a, that's purpose. Yeah. But the idea, right, is the customer buys this for how much? Uh, Six, two, three, four dollars. It really depends on the store. Yeah, okay. Okay, for one straw, two, three, or four bucks. Oh, that's our that wholesale include... price. But, oh, yeah, um, yeah. yeah. Yeah, and then they can reuse it, bring it with them, come back, you give them a discount because they brought their own straw, whatever you want to do. And cafes can use them as well, rather than when they're serving a smoothie if it's an eating situation. Mm. You're serving a drink and you want to include a straw with it. Mm. So then you soak it after it's been used, yeah, yeah. and at the end of the day, you stick it in the cutlery container in the dishwasher yeah. and you can reuse your straws as well. Yeah, yeah. That's cool. G'day Peter. 
Uh, if anyone's got any questions on myself or Judy or anyone else, then just put them in the chat box. Now, these are the reusable juice containers that you actually put the juice in when you sell them. And I got given one already today and I couldn't believe it. I was like, I've got to give this back, but no, this is what, when you buy a juice, they put it in one of these and... The cold press keep bottle. It's called the cold press keep bottle. So you bring it back and you get a discount next time, a dollar off. And um, if you're a, if you're an operator, what are these actually? You pay cost you about sixty cents. You're selling your juice for six or seven bucks, um, and that is just going. What to else makes you that kind of margin in your cafe? Yeah, that's going to give you an enormous amount of uh, goodwill too. Yep. Thanks very much. Thank you. No, thank you, Judy. Keep juicing. Keep juicing on, people. All right, let's move on. We're going now to something else that's pretty cool. Going down here, got the beers going, mate. What's going on? Say hello to are, are we just on your personal? No, no, this is my Facebook group. For what? For coffee. For what? I'm a coffee consultant and I yeah. have a group of people who look to me for guidance and they want to know what's the latest innovation and what you're selling today. At Are they really excited about the about the potential for the 25 grand a year instant asset write-off? I'll, I'll get a tax plug in here. Yeah. No? I'm sure they would be. Oh, you should Please be. Please do tell. Because you've probably already spent all your money so you don't need anything else. But it's a, it's a vote buyer. So, yeah. I'm Chris, I'm an accountant, so we'll do Okay. Like a beer. You got a beer for me? Yeah. Absolutely. I better come back. I better come back. I've got to keep working. I've got, I've got to show some people some good stuff. Um, you got to work the crowd. I'll be back. I'll be back for our beer with you, mate. All right. Coming down here to one of my favourite machines, coffee machines that I've seen today. Let's see if we can give it a test drive. Here we go. I'm back. All right, so this is it. This is the Seneso fine bit of equipment. And what I'm gonna do is give it a little test drive as soon as I can get someone to come and help me. I had a helper here, but he's disappeared. So anyway, what I'll do, pour a coffee and show you how it works. Um, yeah. Yeah. How you going, Peter? Anyone's got any questions, put them in the chat box. Let me know what you want. Good crowd here. Plenty of coffee roasters. Plenty. Plenty of uh, people with equipment, and uh, I've just got someone here to help me. So thanks very much. Hi. What's your name? Kayla. Kayla. Here, it's going to show me uh, again how to use the Seneso. I'll just basically, if you don't mind, if you could hold the camera for an hour and I'll just... You could put it on me. Manual profile, and we can 
Sabre as a volumetric profile. But like all Sinesos, you've got a full touch steam on, um, mixing valve, so you can control your hot water temperature over here, um, heat exchange with a steam boiler, and multi boiler, so you can choose your boiler temperatures as well. How, how lovely is that? Happy to help! Woohoo! Yeah, thank you, that's awesome. Sorry. So that was really good, but I think, you know, like, the purpose of that really is to basically just soften the... the Super soft saturation. Yeah, 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 it's just basically giving the, uh, the coffee cake the, the kindest treatment possible and not just blasting it with hot water, but just drawing the extraction yeah. out. Super low, soft saturation, it's the variable you want to control, but, um, yeah, yeah, no worries. Hey, thank you, that's You're awesome. Welcome. All right, I'd say realistically. Uh, it smells divine too. Alright, well that's the Seness. So, we're going to put that down there and uh, there was one more thing I wanted to show you actually. This is a really new innovation. The next thing I want to show you, and it's around here. Here we go. Mocha pan coffee. Okay. And what these guys have is the nitro cold brew. So this is really cutting edge technology and get a demo on how it works in a second. But you can see behind me, it's basically a tap system where you're going to get nitro brew coffee. Oh, they're running, they're scurrying for the covers behind me, but don't worry, we'll get, we'll get some help here. Guy said I can pour one. Oh. Yeah, how you going? You mind? I'm good. Here we go. So this is how it works. First of all, check this out. Hello, Lou. What the hell are you doing here? I'm up to my cheeky self as usual. Okay. Oh, I'm taking over the joint. Over there, I just seen actually. So underneath we have a keg, okay, of your cold brew coffee. Since that's just going to be, you know, like your pour over or your drip filter or whatever it is, condensed, add the water, put it in the keg, and that's coming out of a keg. It's going up your lines and they're giving it a blast of nitrogen, okay? Which essentially Whoop, not that one. So that's your normal cold brew, right? That's, that's your normal cold brew. Try culprit. Well, that's probably about it. Let me know if there's anything else you want to see, and I'll just keep the, the um, camera rolling for a few minutes. And uh, I think I'll 
I've done the Uber milk. I've showed you the Uber milk, an automated milk frothing system. Uh, I've, sh I've showed you the cold breath press juices, which are amazing. And you've looked at the Seneso coffee machine, which is a very sophisticated uh, extraction method. And now, you've seen Nitro Cold Brew. Let's go and say hi to Luke. Did you try it? No, I've never, never had the opportunity. To oh, it's yeah. really good. Yeah. I'm surprised it wasn't here. Yeah. No. Yeah, you think someone would be sort of, you know? I think it's just such a grey area. Like it freaks a lot of people out. Oh, look at though. I wouldn't care if they weren't. I mean, obviously, they wouldn't be giving free samples of it here. But if you could pay for it, it and have, it, have, have it here, I'll, yeah, I'd have a go here. Yeah, I did. Like. Actually, a customer of mine brought it. We're talking about um, yeah, this monkey poo coffee. It's a cat, isn't it? A cat. It's a cat or a monkey? Yeah, it's a cat. Is it actually yeah. a cat? Is it? Um, she brought it back from Vietnam, and I um, put it through the coffee machine, and yeah, I couldn't get enough of it. But I made one of my customers a cup, and she, oh, she was that mortified. I nearly lost her for life. She was so freaked out by it. You know, because she drank it. And, oh, right. she and then you told her. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, maybe tell them. <laughs> but anyway. So anyway, yeah, that's what we're, we're on live Facebook. You're in the group. So um, people, say goodbye. Hope you've got some value out of that. I'm out for now. Plenty more coffee to drink. We'll um, we'll catch up soon. Bye.